Every year at the beginning of April, April 1st to be exact, is something called April Fool's Day. It's a day where people can play jokes on other people and suspect that they will never get it until they realize what the date is. So let's dig deeper into the history of April Fool's Day. sneezed or had any problems when I cut grass as a kid. I go start cutting grass now as a big man. Big man. Breathe really loud. Takes a lot of energy to eat. I got pain on my pants. Working man. Yeah, okay. Alright. Yes, sir, E Bob. Yeah. Oh, look at that. They got snacks. Mmm. Oh yeah. Now you get some paint. Get some paint. Let's see here. A value bucket. Well, they got Duncan Sheik playing over the intercom. I can't find you here. Don't know who I'm kidding. Our one, our all white. Oh, okay. Yeah, high gloss. Yeah, I'll probably get the, uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. The John Deere Z track. Yeah, I can cut my lawn and drink a beer. Cut my lawn and drink a beer right now. Oh, wait, 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 wait. You hear that? Shh, shh, just listen. That's the sound of my wife not being here. <laughs> I'm stuck my own YouTube channel here, so here's my Home Depot haul. I got Bear Premium Plus Ultra Pure White Paint. This guy said, this boy comes up to me, he goes and he says, uh, you need help or you need help? And I said, yeah, give me some paint. And I want the stuff that looks like a mirror. So I got the high gloss, $47 after tax. My grandfather taught me three important things in life. You know, it's these long night drives that make me thinking about a lot of things in life. It makes me think, where, you know, where did I go wrong? Or maybe where did I go right? You know, I could have been in a better spot or it could have been a worse spot. But hey, that's just life, that's how life is, you know what I'm saying? As I was looking through all the snacks and drinks at the Home Depot, I saw the Coke, I saw the Sprite, and then I saw this Peeps Pepsi, and I was just like, ugh, ugh. I'm a simple man. Give me, give me just the original. 
Don't, don't try to make everything all special and all that. Just give, give me the original flavors. I'm a simple man. Like that song, Simple Man. You know, that by, uh, simple kind of man. You know, because I'm a simple man. And, and that song, he says he's a simple man. And it's like, yeah, I can relate. Because I'm a simple man. I don't need to buy that album. I don't need to buy that CD. You know, they don't sell CDs that much anymore at Best Buy. You know, you can go to Best Buy, you can find all kinds of CDs. Not so much anymore. Now you got some little guy in a polo shirt, an LG polo shirt, trying to sell me an oven. Every single time I go in there, I try to find a Brownsville Station album on CD. Trying to sell me a oven that talks so check these out these are my new kits do you know there's people that have over 20 pairs of shoes can you believe that i got three pairs of shoes i got these when i go out with my wife and i got my grass cutting shoes and then i got some nice dress shoes simple man how's that song go it's like just take your money and get a beer and sit down and be a simple kind of man oh i hope you understand simple kind of man I could, I could definitely understand what it'd be like, you know, listen to that song. It's like, yeah, just take it easy. Just sit down. Just don't do anything. Just be simple. I like that. I can relate. Simple mind, simple man. Yeah, I like that. Got a simple mind, simple man, simple life, simple, simp. Pow, pow. Watch, I can... I could kick in them. I could kick in them. I could jump. Remember when Bush Beer did that commercial and they had that song? That was perfect marketing. Bush. They had that big mountain and everything. And then it had that song. Be a simple kind of man. That, my eyes, my ears perked up when I heard that, and then I saw the beer, and it just things connected in my old simple brain, and then I was like, oh yeah, I could use a bush, bush light, bush beer, a beer, simple man, Home Depot. <laughs> Come on, kids, we're going to the Home Depot. And if you're good, you may get a Coca-Cola. <laughs> you gotta think about things. Even though you're a simple kind of man, you gotta think what's the output, what's the outlook on it. You go to the college, you get your little degree, and then you go get a job. Why you gotta get a job? To get money. So why do you get money? So you can get the house, the car, the girl, the wife, you know. And why do you need money again? Well, once you have the wife, you have your kids, and then kids, they cost money, and then, well, why, after that, why do you want the kids? And then you gotta think, well, why do I want kids? Is it just something that I, and programmed as a human that I'm hardwired that I need to have children because it's some instinctual thing compounded in my brain since the dawn of time from a million generations back that hey it's that biological time and just something goes off in your head and you say hey it's about that time you know you need to have your kids well why why do I need to have my kids it's because this biological thing in my head's telling me and it's like, oh, I guess so. It's like the programming is controlling me. 
I don't have any grasp on my own biological thing. It's just something that needs to be done. And you think, well, you need your kids so you could have a nice family and all that, but why do you need a nice family? Answer me that. Why do you need a nice family? I don't know. I'm a simple kind of man, you know. Do I need a family? A simple man won't need a family. Just make your money, take your time, sit down, have a bush beer, be a simple kind of man, don't worry. You'll understand. Be a simple kind of man. You want to see my CD collection? Got five finger death punch, a filter, phantom moss, fat boy slim. We got corn, la bouche, LL Cool J, mama said knock you out. The crash test dummies, God shuffled his feet. Lip biscuit, chocolate starfish, Lincoln Park hybrid theory. R.I.P. Chester Bennington. We've got Rammstein. You've got Bloodhound Gang. Taco After Eight. The Birthday Massacre. I love this album. This is a great album. We've got Eminem. Eiffel 65. Savage Garden. Lady Gaga. Too Short. Michael Jackson, Metallica, Saliva, Tattoo, Taylor Swift, Darren Styles, 303, Wesley Willis, Turd, hey, there's Duncan Sheik, just like we heard at Home Depot. We've got Seal, Nirvana, we got all kinds of Nickelbacks, and of course, you gotta have your Ted Nugent and your Ariana Grande and your Depeche Mode Ultra, ATB, Anthrax, and and you gotta have your Steel Panther. Ah, uh, oh, April Fools!